anywhere. I will do anything. I will become whatever I need to be so that you know how much I love you. Where is God in all of this? Well, the answer is right here. You see, people cry out, where is God in all of this? And the answer is in this room. The answer is every time we sit down with somebody to cry. And every time we make a meal for somebody. And every time that we speak life into death. You see, John didn't want us to miss the second part of the Christmas story. Yes, God came down to be with us. But there's more than that. The word became flesh and dwelt among us. And how does that happen now? What about now? What, where is God in a world where people are hungry? Where is God in a people where people are broken and lonely? God is right here in this room. You see, as young preachers, we have the opportunity to be the word. The word became flesh and dwelt among us. Remember the word? Remember what it was? It was this part of God that can take nothing and make something out of it. That can take chaos and confusion and speak order. That can take death and speak life into it. And every time we stand in the pulpit and we speak respect to intolerance. Every time we speak life to death. Every time we speak care to a world that doesn't care about anybody. The word becomes flesh and dwells among us. See, Christmas is not just, it's not just an event. Christmas happens every day. Every time we say yes to God, every time that we act in love, every time we give, every time we speak the word, Christ is born. Would you bow your heads with me? Emmanuel, God with us. Help us not to miss it. Because if we miss you, we miss the whole story. Lord, help us not as young preachers to speak just with words of life, but to embody the word. Lord, may we put on the word. May we be the system that you used to put flesh on the love of God. May you use our words to speak life into death, light into darkness. To speak grace and truth into a world that needs grace and truth. Emmanuel, God with us, open our eyes to see and our ears to hear. In the name of the one who stepped down from heaven to live a